are the engineering class from Gary, Nebraska, a small town in West Nebraska with a population of 8,360. And although our community is small, we have big dreams of leaving a legacy and helping our community and communities around the world. This is Eric Crane, and I'm from Gearing High School. Um, this year, I'm part of the Samsung Software Tomorrow team for 2018, and this year we're working on a three-stage microplastic filtration system. While being presented with our STEM design problem this year, we have decided to embark on tracking and grow the growing problem of microplastics showing up in local and global water supplies. And it's estimated that around 20,000 microplastics can be, be run through your washer and your dryer any, any time of the day when you're doing laundry. Our design is a three-stage filter system. The system is gravity-fed and will be implemented behind the washing machine. That and prevent that much more contamination going into the water supply. The filters are progressively smaller as the water goes through the filtering system. Our first design had a 100, 10, and 1 micron filter. Finding a solution to flooding someone's home was another concern that we addressed and found a way to bypass the filter system if the filters become clogged. We implemented a bypass system um, we put a hole in the drywall so that any homeowner could just pull off a simple plastic plate and be able to tell when their system is running through the bypass. So to implement our 300 micron filter, we had to design and print a casing to fit the 300 micron filter. Well, these were our original prototypes and it was going to be a three stage system with uh, all these stacked on top of each other and the first one would be 300 to 100. Inside there's a little sock that is our filter. The first one would be 300 to 100, second one would be 100 to 50, and the last one would be 50 to 10. So it would just filter out all the little microplastics. We were very successful in removing all of the microplastics from the gray water exit and feel that this is something that may one day be required of all washing machines to help preserve our water supply for future generations. Our class here has created um, our final prototype with the 3D printed filter along with two PVC filters. The students at Gearing feel very blessed to be able to be part of such a fun, educational, and important design problem.